Hello, I'm Sheena from BMED's Public Library, and today I want to tell you about a book I like called Bunny Cakes. This book is by Rosemary Wells, and it's about Max and his sister Ruby. They're both making birthday cakes for their grandmother's birthday. Ruby makes an angel surprise cake with raspberry and frosting, and Max makes an earthworm cake with mud and caterpillar icing and red hot marshmallow squirters. If you want to learn how to make a cake like Ruby, a raspberry fluff angel surprise cake, you can check out a cookbook from our library and learn how to make lots of real food with your grown-ups. If you want to make something more pretend and fun with mud, we're going to do that here today. So, bunny cakes, give it a look. And I know grown-ups that playing with mud sounds really messy, but it's this great childhood memories and it's also a great sensory activity. For young children it's great for them to learn how to scoop and pour and stir and for older children I suggest getting out your measuring cups and starting to learn fractions. So today we're going to learn how to follow a recipe. Here is a recipe. I wrote this based on a recipe I used or well I made up when I was a kid called birdseed tacos. So here's the ingredients. It needs one big cup of dirt, one small cup of water, three spoonfuls of bird seed or just dry grass seed from your yard, needs some leaves and some dandelions, and then we follow the directions. It says to mix together dirt, water, and bird seed. Put in the leaves like tacos. Put dandelion bits on top like pretend cheese. Let's give it a try. So first we have one big cup of dirt, pour it in our pot. Next we have one small cup of water, which I'll pour out of my watering can. Pour that in. Three spoonfuls of bird seed. One, two, three. Here's the fun part, you get to mix it up. All right, I'm hoping that this mixture is more like Play-Doh not so much like soup. So if it starts to look like soup, you should add more dirt. I want it to be gloopy and crumbly. Perfect. Okay, so now we're gonna lay out some leaves. One, two, three to start with. And you put some of your birdseed mud onto your leaves. Just like that. Does not look pretend delicious. And we're going to put on the little bits of yellow. I'm going to pull them out of dandelions. And on top, like some cheese. Wonderful. And then you can fold them up, and these tacos are ready to pretend to eat. Now, if you like crispy tacos, you can put these on a hot sidewalk for a while, and they'll get nice and dry. And that's how you make birdseed tacos. Thanks for watching. Now, we also have one other thing to tell you about. We are going to have a mud pie contest at the library. So we would like you to make your own mud pie, earthworm cake, brownies, mud cookies, whatever you would like, and then take a picture of it. And then you can email that picture to us here at the library, and we'll enter you in a drawing to win a real chocolate pie one you can eat. If that sounds like fun to you, take a look at the contest rules and send us your picture. Thank you and have a great day.